What's going on guys and in this video I'm gonna show you how to create a slideshow using only CSS and HTML. Uh, let's get started. So first of all we need to start with our HTML file which I have already created and it's created and it's called index.html and it has title called image slide and as you can see here and then the div class of container and then inside that I have two more divs called window and overlay so in our HTML there is only divs basically and I've also linked my CSS file to the HTML file and now let's go into our CSS file and I have already done something here that is give the body a background of this gray and then give it a height for future users and then margin of zero and why I put the margin is because if I don't have it um, let me just see uh, it will have a scroll wheel when I put the, specify the height to 100 pH that's because the browsers have predefined margins in them so we need to put them to be zero so let's move on to our container since I have two divs inside of it, I need position to be relative. Since I want those two divs to be close to each other. And now we will move on to our window where the images will be. So I am going to keep it a bit It 50 pixels and then a height 450 sorry um, I'm gonna give it a 750 and here I am gonna give it a 350 pixels and then I am gonna use a property called background image which lets you basically um, import image using CSS directly so you don't need to specify the image here instead of that you can call a div and then specify the image here so this file is what I have here so I have an image inside of it this three, these three images so I'm gonna import this image one right now so I will just put this colons inside the URL and then img since it's inside of that folder and image1 and it should be working there you go it's working now and there seems to be some problems here hold on let me just now um 800 itself and now you can see it's pretty much messed up so there is this horizontal scroll here and vertical scroll we should be coming but it's margin in zero nothing happens and the image is not proper here it's just offset so like something is cropped and the image quality is poor so for Fixing that, I'm gonna give it a background size and then I'm gonna give it cover so it basically fits correctly with the given dimensions, width and height. So there's still the scroll wheel, but we'll get rid of that later. And now I need to. Yeah, I need to do the overlay. Before that, I need to show you how to create the slide. So basically, we need a at keyframes. We need to create an animation. So for that, I'm gonna use at keyframes and then slide. So this is the basically the animation name. And 
now I am gonna give it a 25% and background ground background image and in URL and image slash image one so actually I don't actually need so actually I don't need this one everything is gonna be working from the slide I mean the animation and at 50% I will have background made of two actually let me just copy this okay copy the whole line copy and paste paste And here I'm gonna put 75 and then here 100 so it's completed but we need to change the images so this is gonna be 2 this is gonna be 3 and 4 so if you see this percentage numbers here I have equal divided them to 4 so you can say um, 4 images total and then I am gonna specify the animation so animation then I'm gonna give it its name as slide so this name is user specified so you can put any name here and then the animation duration which I'm gonna put to 10 seconds and to say slideshow I needed to extend a little more bit and then finally animation duration count to infinity since I want it to be going forever so I don't want it to stop and also for the scroll bar I am gonna give it a overflow hidden so it's gone and let's just look at it there you go it's working and Oh, what's happened? Okay, so when the last image comes, it's just disappearing for just a second. For getting rid of that, I'm gonna give it a background image of the image for so basically the last image. So let's look at this now. right now it's working smoothly but I need this one to be centered so for that I am gonna give it a display flex display sorry flex and then justify content center align items also center no no Okay, so now it's basically aligned right in the middle and it's looking great. So as a bonus code, I'm going to show you how to create a image overlay and I want it to be a little darker here. So let me just do that with my overlay. There. So if you remember we have this container and inside that we have both window and overlay tips. So I'm gonna give it a width of 800 pixels itself and then a height, height of 400 pixels just like this one and then I'm gonna give it a background color of this color for just now me. Uh, I will change the color it's just for you to understand so now we have this red overlay in the down since you know we have both the divs so first div is gonna be here and then the second div which is on down of it sorry on the bottom of it and now I need this one to overlap this one or just became an overlay so for that I'm gonna give it a 
position absolute so that it's free to move and then I'm going to give it a top of zero so it won't occupy any space on the top in this container so this container have this too so let's just see all right now our images are covered with this one so now it's just a matter of changing the color to this dark and then a transparency just the alpha so there you go it's having a nice overlay it's looking a bit dark and I prefer this look more than the first one so that's it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned something new on the way and I will see you guys in the next video until then goodbye